Hey everybody, today I'm gonna to talk about some new features in the latest version of Filmora, Filmora 13.6. So in yet another update, we've got a lot of new features to check out. There's an AI object remover, smart search, voice cloning, an AI sticker generator, music generator, vocal remover, skin tone protection, pro video scope. So a lot of new features to check out for, to look out for in 13.6. Today, I'm gonna focus on the AI object remover. So in this video, I've got a, a person walking onto a mountaintop. And let's say I wanna cut out this, this person from, from this video. So the, what's challenging about this is that this, this person is, is, is moving throughout the video. So it's not just a static, static cutout. It's not like a regular, you know, Photoshop edit where you're just cutting out a static image. In this case, it's a bit more challenging because we're, we're cutting out a moving object, but it's still possible and really easy to do in Filmora 13.6. So with the clip selected, there is a, a button here for AI object remover. And as you'll see, it says supports clips under one minute. So this isn't gonna work for really long clips, obviously, because it's a fairly time consuming process because it has to identify the object and cut it out throughout the entire video. Now, if I click on this, I'll see the, the video. So I've got an interface here. And what I'm gonna do is just through, midway through the video here, I'm just gonna use this marker to cut out or highlight the object, roughly, not specifically. And you can see it's detected it's detected that image, that object that I want to cut out. Now, when I was first using this, I thought that I have to do frame by frame or help it do, do multiple selected objects. But what's really cool about this AI object remover is that's actually all I need to do. If I hit the remove button, you'll notice now it's actually going to start tracking that object throughout my video. So even though I haven't gone through the process and gone frame by frame or every few seconds reselecting the object, with Filmora's object remover, it's actually gonna track that object throughout my video. You can see as that object is moving, I don't have to reselect what I wanna cut out. The object remover is automatically detecting and tracking that object as it's moving throughout the video. So it's gonna go at the, uh, towards the end of my video and also at the start. So it's gonna detect you know, where, that, where that object was at the beginning and at the end. So it's a really, really cool and effective feature saving you a lot of time because you know, in the past, what you may need to do is go through frame by frame and to make sure you've, you've selected the entire object along the way. But with this, it takes care of the object tracking for you so that all you need to do is just select it at, at a certain point in your video. Now, if for some reason it didn't capture everything, you, you do have the ability to go through at different times in your video and to make those, make those adjustments. But as you can see, even as the object is larger, you know, at the beginning of, of the video, as he's walking in to the shot, it's still adjusting for that. So it's a really, really easy way to apply these, these edits because Filmora's AI is basically doing that for me. So now it's running through the process of now actually removing that object from my video. And so now the cutout is complete. And now when I run the video, you can see that that object has been entirely removed from the clip, from the start and the end all throughout the video. So I didn't have to cut out along the way. I just had to make one selection. And through that motion tracking, that object tracking, Filmora 13's AI was able to do the rest and remove that. So all I've got left now is a nice video of the, of the mountaintop, of uh, the clouds, of the sun, so exactly what I wanted. So with, with smaller images or, or smaller objects to cut out, it's probably gonna be even easier. With this case, you know, I used a, a more complex scenario where we're, we're cutting out a moving object, a person, who's you know changing in, in size and shape during the entire video and Filmora's AI was able to do that with without any issues. So if you've got Filmora 13.6 it's definitely a feature you're going to want to check out cuz it's it, it can make your photo your video editing process a whole lot quicker and easier. 